On the used boat market, there's quite a few Flybridge cruisers available, but not as many convertibles. So this week on Foodytis, we're going to take a look at a solid performer from the 90s, this 95 Silverton 41 convertible. Built from 1991 to 1999, the 41C was a value-priced sedan with great looks and plenty of standard features, like the oversized cleats and hossers, city water inlet, shower, bait prep station or wet bar, and refrigerator found in the cockpit. While designed in the 1990s, the 41C is still a stylish looking convertible. The molded steps, wide side decks, and tall welded rails aid getting around on deck. The foredeck is expansive, but the old style road only windlass at the pulpit needs to be upgraded. Entering the salon, there is a pull out sofa to port facing well crafted cabinets. Moving through the salon, down is a spacious galley with an electric range, multiple cabinets, large single sink, microwave, and a three-quarter AC fridge. Opposite is a very desirable and comfortable dinette. Fully forward is the master cabin, which has an island berth. The brightly lit cabin features overhead cabinets, two hanging lockers, and a dressing table. The head with access from both the master and the companionway has a full vanity, separate shower, and ceramic tiles. For children or the occasional guest, there is a small side cabin with bunks. Now one feature that makes these 90s era 41 Silverton so popular is here in the salon. It's absolutely massive, it's got great windows, light and ventilation. And what makes it so big? Well there aren't too many boats from the 90s at 41 feet that have a beam of 14 feet 10 inches making all of the space and it's a great place to kick back and relax. A great place it is since the facing cabinets that were offered in oak or cherry hide the entertainment system plus storage. One of the things that makes the 41 quite popular with buyers in the used market is the size of the flybridge. You have wonderful expansive wraparound seating and seating here in front of the helm for guests and a really nicely laid out helm for the captain. One of the things you always have to take into consideration when buying a larger cruising boat like this is what kind of electronics will come with the boat. In this case, it's a mix of older style along with temporary new equipment to move the boat around. But you have to factor in that there's going to be some replacements and some work to clean up this electronic cluster here. So you better factor that in to any offer to purchase. Firing up the 41C's 502 Big Box creates a great sound. But for long range cruising, the optional diesels would be a better option. Underway, the Silverton 41C feels like the 25,000 pound cruiser she is, but still delivers a cruise of 19 to 20 knots. Keeping it at 1400 RPM will be much kinder to your wallet. Now when I was doing my research on the internet prior to spending the afternoon on the Silverton 41C, I was quite pleased to find 12 really good examples in just a few minutes. So if you're in the market looking for a good used sport fish, something as large and comfortable as this Silverton truly is, take a look on BoatBuys.ca or BoatTest.ca to find the boat that you're looking for.